Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to Morning Guides, a YouTube channel that main goal is to make you better at editing. In this tutorial, I'm about to explain to you how you can remove any object using the features of the free version. So without wasting any more time, let's begin with the tutorial. Alright, so to get started, I'm selecting the clip that I have on my timeline and I'm going to the color tab. Once you're there, you need to select this window right here and select this curve tool right here. After you did that, you want to draw a mask over the object that you wish to remove. If the object or camera is moving, you want to use the tracking system so that you're sure that the mask that you have just made is always on the object that you wish to remove. So in order to do that, you need to press this tracker and then hit play so it can scan the whole clip and follow the motion of the video so that the masking is not going on places which you don't want to remove. And like on the video will be appreciated. Please. And as you just saw, I just did all of these and now I'm gonna move the mask over the forehead and I'm moving into the forehead because I want to get a piece of there and place it over the eyebrow. And once I did that, I want to go to sizing, which is right here and make sure that node sizing is open. And then on sizing, I'm going to tilt and I'm dragging it to the left side so I can reduce the value of tilt until I see that the skin is over the eyebrow. This, this, this is not okay. This needs to stop now. And yeah, I know that it's looking terrible right now, but we're gonna fix that in a matter of seconds. So we can go back on the window tab and then on the right side on the softness, we can play with the soft one and inside outside until we get smooth edges and it looks more realistic. Every video is independent, so there's not uh, strict values for everyone. So you have to adjust them the way that you like them. So you can check that out and see what's best for you. Hey, that's pretty good. And if you also think it's pretty good, leave a like on the video. Now let's just check it out what I just made. So this is the result. And if you have any object other than this to remove from the video, you can go back on the color tab, duplicate the note and repeat the same process with the masking, tracking and softness and you're ready to go. If this video was helpful, useful or anything, leave a comment, like and subscribe for more. Please. See you in the next one.